go. Stuff How fun Friday. is it? I, let me tell you, I can barely smell right now because of my allergies, <laughs> and it smells great. Market Wagon <laughs> is helping connect Kentuckians with local farmers online. We love this, and Kentucky Proud products are, of course, the best. No oh, doubt about no it. Doubt. Joining us this morning to show us how it's all done, Holly Hatmaker. So Holly, what are you making for us today? Well, um, so we're coming off of the summertime seasonal farmers markets and everybody goes to the farmers market during the summer. But once kind of tomatoes stop, people think, well, I can't go to the farmer's right. market anymore. Well, that's not true. There are still plenty of awesome things that you can buy that are locally made. And so Market Wagon kind of helps you transition from going out to the farmer's market to just doing it from your house. So Market Wagon um, has 60 vendors online. So you just sit on your couch, sit Love at your this. house and look through awesome, great locally made uh, products. We've got vegetables and meats. Um, there's pre-made meals if you don't want to even cook. Um, lots of great things. So to get in kind of the fall spirit, I'm sorry, I should have made tacos if I had done my research. Don't we, we you can worry do, about We can it. put this on a taco shell. Don't so, you worry. But, but it's getting cooler, <laughs> so it's chili season. So we've got um, a lamb, black bean, and sweet potato chili. Mm. So kind of different than your normal chili, um, but we're using ground lamb that was produced um, in Bourbon County from oh. Schwartz Meat Company. Um, we have sweet potatoes and onions and garlic from our farm, Hatmaker Homestead. And um, peppers are kind of on the way out for the season, um, but you can still find some locally um, bell peppers, poblanos, and the great thing about this is that you can make it all in one pot. I need easy one pot. So Sounds as a good. mom and as a farmer, I don't have a lot of time, right. and so you just take your ground lamb and you're going to brown that first, put it in the pot, and then just put everything in. I mean, we're just going to add it all. We're going to add I our peppers. It and our onions, and then we add our um, tomato, diced tomatoes. If you've canned over the summer mm -hmm. and you've got tomatoes put up, you could even use those instead and some beef broth. All we're gonna season it with is some chili powder. That's all the seasoning you need because all these great local ingredients are gonna give you the your flavors that you need and you don't have to add a lot of spices to it. A little salt, a little pepper, depending on your, your taste. You're gonna let this cook for about 30 minutes. Just let all the juices get going and then, then we add the secret weapon, oh. mm. the sweet, sweet potatoes. potatoes. And so, of course, like those are really coming in right now. People are digging those up. And then we're just going to let this cook for another 30 minutes. Get it all together, um, tasting good. And um, and it's, it's a great one pot. It's my kids even like it. You know, um, kids are kind of weird if you say like that you're going to eat lamb. Mm -hmm. They're kind of like, that's different. Like, what? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. But <laughs> once you get all the flavors in there, like you can't tell. Just call it chili. It's just chili. They don't need to know the details. It's deep. just chili. <laughs> well, it, it looks the same. You know, it, it, it does. It looks just so. the same. And then, um, of course, and it freezes well too if you were wanting oh, that to is freeze. Nice. Um, and then, um, of course, like now, in my household, my husband is the condiment guy, and so <laughs> so we've got to have, you know, we can add our cheese, oh, yes. our fresh cilantro. Mm -hmm. um, cilantro likes it when it's a little cooler outside, so cilantro is going to be great to get locally right now. Um, and then a little sour cream, you could put a little diced avocado, some broken tortilla chips, all of those. Um, we've got the nice pretty one here in the front to show, and then you're ready for dinner. It looks amazing. That, I might have to try a little bit. That Just does look by, amazing. You know, I I just, really I'm, I'm obsessed with sweet potatoes. Well, especially. a lot of people think that chili is just, you know, tomatoes, mm. ground beef, and some beans, but you can really make it versatile and use those locally made products, locally grown. Um, and Market Wagon allows you to um, to shop that way all year round, um, and you're able to support our local farmers um, that, you know, get a lot of support during the summertime. But then when we move into cooler seasons, people just don't think about purchasing local and so there's there's 60 vendors um, the best thing I hadn't said is market wagon delivers oh nice, yeah, that is nice. it delivers you make your list like a Kroger shopping list mm -hmm. and they deliver it to your doorstep I did it one day just because I wanted to see what the other end of it looked like they sent me a picture of this nice bag sitting on my doorstep and there was all of my locally sourced products right at my doorstep ready for me to cook sure. and it just everything tastes better number one but you also feel better when you know that you're supporting your you know your friends your neighbors mm -hmm. people you go to church with people right down the road That's so that right. makes a huge difference and you grew up on a farm right is that what you were telling us uh, I did yeah I, I grew up kind of more in the livestock industry mm -hmm. 
Um, but my husband and I bought a farm out in Bourbon County and uh, we raise uh, pasture-raised poultry. Um, Right now, Market Wagon just opened up their pre-sale for turkeys, for fr oh, Thanksgiving turkeys. Nice. Oh. Fresh, never frozen turkeys for Thanksgiving. Um, and it's be delivered the Tuesday before Thanksgiving. Really? And so you can have your turkey delivered right to your doorstep, fresh, ready for you to make. See, that's what I've been looking for. I've been looking for some more local meat. Then I know it's mm -hmm. out there and available. And this right here just takes care of not only that, takes care of Beef, everything. pork, chicken, turkey, bison. Ooh, bison is delicious. I, I was recently introduced to bison. It's so good. That, that, where there's actually a, a market wagon vendor, um, and they're from Bourbon County as well. Oh, Very we nice. We've got some great farmers in Bourbon County. Not not to take away we from other that. counties, right. but... Yes, well, you're allowed to brag on your hometown. But, uh, That's 14 okay. 14 county radius around the Lexington area is what market wagon delivers to. And so you can be up towards Winchester, Richmond, uh, Frankfurt, and get that delivered to your doorstep it's every Tuesday. Our I viewing love, area. I love how easy it is, too, to mm -hmm. do it. Just walk us through that process real quick. Uh, you just go to www.marketwagon.com and it'll come up and it'll have a little box that you type in your area code. So it'll bring you up to the Lexington Market and then you can shop by category, dairy, uh, vegetables, meats, all of those. And you just go through there, put it in your cart, just like your online shopping. It. And um, so it's weekly. And so on, it'll close on a Sunday night. And so on Monday morning, I get a list that says, here's what's been purchased from your customers. And I get it ready. And on Tuesday morning, I take it to Lexington, drop it off at the hub, and um, they take it out and deliver it to the people. That is such a great process. So easy, too. It really too, is. You know, Send you a text message that says you're, it's on the way that it's been delivered to your house and I'm gonna have to check out those pre-made meals too there's <laughs> that's 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 part single my single serving um, single meals um, with locally made products and yeah that's that's, wonderful. A, that's a big hit y'all have the setup this is a uh, really is a fantastic tool well, we're, to we're very local. we're very blessed to be able to be a part of it because we sell locally here and so we have farmers markets but as you know like produce isn't shelf stable mm -hmm. and so it's got to be able to be grown and then get out the door to the customer and so you know during the week you know that was giving us a great avenue to get things out because farmers markets are on the weekend sure and so you know on a tuesday we're able to pick and get out fresh produce um, to the people in, in our surrounding areas and not just people that live in our particular county. We're able to sell something to someone in Winchester, to someone in Richmond. It's a wonderful resource. Such a great idea. I'm surprised someone didn't think of this sooner, but I love it. And if we know how to go to um, marketwagon.com. Yes, now, what if people want to come see you specifically? Um, so we, we have a website. It's hatmakerhomestead.com. We're really active on social media on our Facebook and Instagram pages. Uh, both of those are Hatmaker Homestead as well. Or we're always set up at the Bourbon County Farm Farmers Market on Saturday mornings, or of course, you can just go to Market Wagon. There you go. Yeah. You can search for um, our name and you'll see our products on there as well. Awesome. Well, Holly, it's been wonderful to have you with Thank us. Thank you so much. Thank you, you for having You did a great us. job, and this tastes amazing. Yeah, Thank you. Really good. Amazing. Thank you. All right, moving on now. Tinnitus is a common issue involving a ringing or buzzing noise in one or both of your ears. It can be constant, come and go, either way. It's annoying. It's real yeah, pain. It's a pain. You're right. Everyday Kentucky's Amber Canoy joins us now with expert advice from the team Bluegrass Hearing. 